everybody, Jonathan Doyle with you once again. Welcome back, friends, to The Daily Message. So good that you could stop by. Please make sure you have subscribed. Hit that subscribe button and go and check out all these links. If you would like private coaching with me, if you'd like to book me for training, for speaking, go and check out all these links, and there's some free stuff in there as well just for you. Over the last few days of episodes, we have been exploring some brilliant insights from some really fantastic people. We've looked at quotes from Theodore Roosevelt, from Winston Churchill, In yesterday's episode, we talked about uh, the insights of Sarah Blakely, America's first self-made billionaire and the sense of being in the wrong life movie. So go back and check yesterday's episode. If you ever feel that you're in the wrong movie and you want to make a change today, we're going to start a three-day run focusing on the insights of my only living hero. My kids joke about this. They say that this guy is dad's only living hero, David Goggins. If you are not familiar with David Goggins, I don't know where to start. Uh, former US Navy SEAL, African-American guy, ultra marathon runner, just, you know, his kind of nickname is the hardest man alive. Why? Because of the incredible physical things he does in his latest book, which I've uh, read twice and listened to twice. He ran the Moab 220, which is a 400 kilometer run. But the reason I love Goggins is because his backstory is profound. Trauma, abuse, violence, just grew up in the most traumatic situation and took all of that and managed to really channel and direct it. So he's been a real kind of remote mentor for me in terms of taking the difficult, hard things of life, turning them around and making something magnificent out of what you've been given, right? So today we're going to jump into a quote from him. I'm going to unpack it. As always, there is a longer version here in the podcast just below the video. So if you want to hear the longer version, go check out the podcast. All right, my friends, you ready? Let's hear from David Goggins. Most of us are not defeated in one decisive battle. We are defeated one tiny, insignificant surrender at a time that chips away at who we should really be. All right, if you're paying attention in life, most of us are not defeated by one single traumatic event. Loss, suffering, difficulty can definitely have a profound impact upon us, but we're not really taken out of the game of life often by one single moment. Now, some of you might think, well, people sometimes go through terrible things and never really recover. We have friends who've been through some really extraordinary things, the loss of a child. And I think it's true that they never necessarily fully recover. Of course they don't from such a terrible loss, but they have found a way to move forward eventually in life. Now, again, that loss is always with them, but no single traumatic event, no matter how devastating it is, can necessarily take you out of the game of life. So what David Goggins is telling us here is it's not one big single defeat that matters. What actually can take us out is daily surrender. Daily surrender is going to look different for every single one of us. For some of us, it's going to be diet and food related. For some of us, it's going to be around integrity or morality. Some of us, is going to be about how we speak, how we talk, how we treat people, how we give in to our temper or we give in to impatience. These daily surrenders from our highest values, like we can easily articulate the things we think are most important in life. We can say, well, I want to be honest, be trustworthy, I want to be courageous. But why are we not often living those things to the fullest of our potential? Well, it's something to do with daily surrender. Most of us are never going to be taken out in one big moment. So I want you to look in your life and ask yourself, where are your daily surrenders? Where are those experiences in your daily life where you are giving in to who you could really be? You know, if you, if you stuck at it, if you uh, had that little moment of perseverance, who could you become? Because that's the game we're playing, right? The game we're playing is the game not of human beings, but of human becomings. Like to teach that principle, right? Who are you becoming? And if you stop surrendering on a daily basis, you're going to find that you start moving faster and faster towards who that person is. So that's my encouragement for you today. Let's focus on becoming human becomings by avoiding the daily surrenders. And you know exactly what I'm talking about, don't you? You know what your daily surrenders are. So be mindful of them as you go through this next 24 hours. Be switched on to where am I surrendering? Where am I surrendering? And take action and take some steps to change that. You just got to be across it first. Get conscious, then change those decision points. Just find yourself, oh, here I am. I'm back at that surrender point. I'm going to take a different path. And that is how a life is shaped. That is how change happens through those tiny little seemingly insignificant moments. All right, that's it for today. We've got two more days of David Goggins quotes. So check back in tomorrow. I got another great message from David Goggins. For now, please make sure you've subscribed. Go check out all the free links. Book me for coaching, speaking. It is all there. My name's Jonathan Doyle. This has been The Daily Message, and you and I are going to talk again tomorrow.